Good day guys, this is Jerdix. So today I'm going to show you how to flash um, file transfer. Not flash. What the fuck? I get that. File transfer to your Xbox um, or FTP, as you would like to call it. File transfer protocol. Okay. I'm going to start with the Xbox first. That's my Xbox down there. What you want to do is you want to connect it to your computer. Computer's LAN plug or Ethernet, if you want to call it, with a crossover cable. So that's a crossover cable there. I might actually have another one. No, I'm not going to be going to go there. My mm, nightmare of cables. And then you want to go to your Xbox. So make sure it's connected to via crossover. I'm not quite sure if a standard cord will work. I don't think it will. That's why I use crossover. Um, you can use Xbox Media Center. That's what this is. But I'm not going to use Xbox Media Center. I'm going to use Unleash X. I'm just going to put this down. I hope you guys can still see that. So, look. Um, okay. I'm going to use Unleash, Unleash X. So we'll go to Unleash X. Okay, you want to go to System, Settings, um, Network. Okay. Make sure you set your, your network type to static. You can set your IP address to that, which is 192.168.0.4. Um, your subnet mask should stay 255.255.255.0. Your gateway, you'll want to set 192.168.0.3 as well as your DNS1. And your DNS2 doesn't really matter. You can just I've got it set to 192.168.0.1 So DNS1 192.168.0.3 Gateway the same as DNS1 And IP, IP address 192.168.0.4 And network type static Also you want to make your username and password Xbox And make sure it's on port 21 So after we've done that you can go to your computer you want to make sure, hang on, where is it? On your computer, have Flash FXP installed. Sorry about that. Okay, so we'll go to Flash FXP now. Ah, uh, where is it? Hang on. I should be using Capture, but I don't want to be switching back between Capture, um, Video Capture, and um, Xbox. Okay, so just to just install it as a free trial and hit accept. It's, I've had it for way more than 30 days and it hasn't even done much. Uh, you want to go to quick... Oh, hang on. First, we have to set up our network. So type in the start menu type network. Uh, you want to go... Um, where is it? Fucking hell. Maybe it's that one. No, okay. View network adapters. I haven't done this. View network connections, that's what I want. I haven't done this for bloody ages. Anyway, um, you want to go to your local area network connection. You want to have properties for it. Click Internet Protocol version 4. Hit properties. Okay, now you want to use, you want to switch it from obtain automatically to use the following. The IP address is 192.168.0.3. Subnet mask is the same as before, 2.5.255.255.255.255.0. Um, default gateway blank. Um, you also want to switch that from obtain automatically and just leave it blank as well. It's what I've got set here. And you just hit close. So now that's all set up. Now you want to go quick connect in Flash FXP. Type the address, which is 192.168.0.4. I'm fairly sure that is it, if I remember. And you want to type your username and password, which is Xbox and Xbox. Also, make sure that it's set to port 21. I'm really sorry I'm not doing capturing for this, so, uh, so hit connect and 
sure enough, there you are. You've got your flash drives on. So you've got E, F, and C. C so don't use, and then you get X, Y, and Z. F drive has got. If you've got it set up with a bigger hard drive than the stock one, F drive has got. For me, it's got my applications, my games, my music, and my videos. Um, e drive can also have your apps. It's, all, it's got your dashboard in it. Um, games which I don't think I have anything there. Saves, and it's got your user, user data, so that's all your save files. It's also got screenshots from Xbox Media Center for some reason. And, yeah. <coughs> e, you don't want to fill E up. Um, C, you don't want to touch, it should be empty. Yeah, it's shadowed. Um, so yeah, just use F, and don't fill up E. So when you want to copy something over, I wonder if I still have some shit to copy over on this hub. On this. Yeah, I've got some stuff on Xbox. Okay, um, I'm not trying this bastard. So, say you want to copy, um, Quake 3 over. Well, this is that's the source port of it. Okay, so you want to go to your F drive or your E drive and you want to go to games and you just simply drag it across. Now, I've already got it on my Xbox, so I won't be doing that. And then after that, since after that's finished copying, it'll it'll finish down here. Reset your Xbox, and it should be automatically in your dashboard. Make sure though you copy the um, the directory with Quake 3 in it as the Xbox executable, etc., etc. In it, you don't want it in you don't want it in a subdirectory. So yeah, and that, my friends, is how you flash transfer. Ah, oh, fuck! I said it again. Flash file transfer to your Xbox. Thanks for watching.